Good morning, everybody. Today is official our first 2021 vlog. I haven't recorded in the last couple weeks. Things have been really crazy, but I do want to go ahead and update you guys on everything we've been doing. I'm going to go ahead and show you our backyard renovation. He's ready with his flip flops. I need a key to the car. Also, if you guys are new to our channel, make sure you go ahead and turn on those notifications and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any more videos. And let's get going. All right, so if you guys can tell, my husband likes to do a lot of the yard work in slippers and shorts, or he'll be in work boots and shorts. Don't ask me. He's whatever gets him through his day. I don't care. Uh, for anybody that's new, let me give you guys a heads up. My husband has renovated most of our backyard all by his lonesome. I'm so proud of him. My backyard looks like a total mess right now. If you go back into a couple of our videos, all of this was dirt. Everything was dirt. There was no grass. It looked just like this. Dirt and weeds. Um, my husband decided we put all grass here and then he built a little deck over there. This was the second project he did to the backyard. You can see here, my husband decked it out. So we have a full on dog pen with some shading, some lighting. We're not done with it, but we got it done to where it's actually functional. We put grass in there. He is going to be doing like a full on dog house back here for them. He's mapping out a 10 by 10. We have to do a foundation. We're going to be putting a shed there where in this shed we will be transferring everything from this shed into that shed and turning this shed into a studio. So 2021 bitches, I'm getting my studio. I'm getting it. Christian ran to Home Depot to get the wood that we need to start the foundation. Let me show you what he has going on right now. We haven't been doing nothing but watching movies all day. That's usually what we do on New Year's. But let me explain real quick. As you guys can see, Christian was worried about it raining underneath. Well, it raining and then there being a puddle underneath the shed. So he wanted to level out the floor to where it would drain into the little drain before we put the foundation. So we had these leftover bricks from the wall back there that we decided to use. So instead of buying pavers, we're gonna use these. All right guys, it is officially Saturday morning, January 20th or January 2nd. Kids are still asleep. Hubby just started the backyard. My beautiful tree is officially going to be taken down. I'm gonna start cleaning everything. I'm gonna make dinner, or I'm gonna make breakfast. I have to clean my kitchen. It's dirty! But let me show you what's going on in the backyard first. Christian, we yesterday went and got some of the wood that we needed to start the foundation. And he went ahead and leveled out the floor, and now he's going to start with the foundation. Also, I wanna show you guys, my backyard is a hot mess. All my nail stuff is in this tent and I have to move everything out of the tent because for some reason when the sun hits the tent it like reflects UV lights and it has ruined most of my gels and some of my liquids and powders it dried up all of my nail glues so I need to find a temporary spot to put everything where it's not gonna damage it anymore and then remove this tent. It was a good idea, but it's just not working for me. So that's going to be another project I need to figure out today because yeah, I it's a lot of money I have invested in everything and I don't want it to go to shit just because I'm being lazy, so yeah. So further ado, let me show you our new addition to the backyard and what we're gonna do with it. All right, so here is the bad boy. This is the 10 by 10. You guys can see Christian got most of it up already. He has to just go ahead and complete the roof and put the doors. How many people are watching you? I don't know yet. Say hi, Dad. Hi, Dad. <laughs> um, we were thinking, so I think what he's going to do is put some windows in there as well. So he's going to 
um, cut some windows out. I got flooring for the shed, which I'm so excited, you guys. I can't wait to show you. Um, it's that peel and stick, but it's like an updated peel and stick. So it's like an expensive type of peel and stick without being expensive, you know what I mean? I did have a box of like a marble peel and stick that I got from my fireplace. I laid it down to see if marble was what I was trying to go for, but I ended up coming across something different and I wanna show that to you because I think it's gonna look really cute and if it looks cute in here, I wanna put it in that bad boy right there too. All right, Christian went ahead and finished the roof. Um, we still have to put like the roofing material, but he did put the plywood. As you guys can see, it's officially covered. Um, this is what it looks like. I have big plans for here. Even though it is like a shed that we're gonna be putting storage in, I'm designing it to be livable. Not livable, but it's gonna be like a legit room. This bad boy. So this is the style of the peel and stick that we got. It is a very durable, more expensive peel and stick. Um, very thick, it does have texture in it, so it feels sturdy. It is a really big piece, so we got five of these. Here's the tile size, if anybody's interested. This is exactly the color. It's like a really light gray. Um, by Traffic Master Peel and Stick. Um, if anybody wants to know, it's the gray liner, I think it says. Anyways, so we got five of those. Me and Christian are about to put it down now. And that's gonna be the last thing that we do today, probably. I also went to Home Depot and picked up this, which I was hoping he would be able to just put a little um, piece up for me because I wanted to see what it looked like. What is this called? What is this? Shiplap. shiplap. So like a shiplap, white, and I kind of, I want to do the shiplap on the ceiling of the tent. Or ceiling, right? Yeah, the ceiling. So because it's so small in here and I don't want the roof to be dropped down and make it look smaller, I just want shiplap like on the roof and maybe on the floor or on the roof instead of and then we're gonna drywall all of this he's gonna build shed so we're gonna do it but ship lab is definitely going on the roof and then the poles or these beams are gonna be exposed so i'm excited you guys ready i'm gonna show you we're gonna do the floor and we're gonna see how that comes out how's it going guys so ash is doing the floor and the shed look at her work guys it's not hard. Look at her. You're doing a good job, babe. Thank you. Good job. Wow. I'm impressed. Oh. Huh, babe? All right, you guys. It's official. It is done. Let me show you. He went ahead and completed it. Put the doors on. We had to put the tarp on because we don't have the roofing material yet, which we are looking into, and he's gonna go ahead and put that on. But we're gonna go ahead and paint everything, make it fit in with the house. I don't know if I need help. So I don't know if I wanna paint this the same color as my house or do something different. Comment below what you guys think. Do you think I should paint it something different or the same color as the house to like flow? Um, but let me show you the inside. All right, so we went ahead and put down the floors. Well, I did. I put all the floors down. Um, I do need to go around and put the flooring in the, up to the baseboard. Christian's gonna go ahead and drywall all of this. Here is Ship Lab. I want him to take the Ship Lab 
and put it in the ceiling. So right here in the middle of the beams, I want him to put the shiplap so that it keeps the ceiling high. Um, and then I want to paint the beams and expose it. So I'm excited. We got a lot done. So it's officially up, it's moving, or it's officially up, ready to be moved in and renovated on the inside. And that will be next. So you guys comment below what you guys think. Are you excited? How do you feel? I love it. I hope this ship lab works though. So we'll see how that goes. I'll update you guys soon.